Hey y'all, welcome to Creatively. Today, we are gonna be doing um, some bird's nest. Um, I figured it's almost Easter, you know, so I need to be getting this project out for you guys. I know we did the um, the Easter wreaths. Well, sorry, my stick's in the way. <laughs> um, we did some Easter wreaths, but now I wanna show you guys some um, bird's nest. Um, that just is springy to me, and what I wanna do with mine is um, make enough to go around my um, dining room table. Um, I want to do like placemats, dishes, bowl, and then I like to do the bird's nest in it for Easter. Um, so, I want to make some. All this come from the Dollar Tree. Already getting messy. Moss. Spanish moss. I got two bags because I want to be doing several. I'm only probably going to do one with you guys on here. Um, but I'm going to make like, let's see, one, two, three, four. Probably about six for my dining room table. And then I got some of the green moss, the reindeer moss. And then I got, um, let's see, you're going to need some acrylic spray, some adhesive spray, and then some sticks. And I made Doug, I asked Doug if he could um, go get me a stick out of the yard, and he brought me a massive, massive stick. <laughs> so we definitely have that covered. Um, cause I want to put things in it that, um, reflects a real bird's nest. I got my hot glue gun just in case we need it. Um, a real bird's nest. So it's messy. You know, we've got the sticks, a grass, anything and everything. Mm. So it's going to be a very messy project. But that's okay. I'll get the sleeper out after I'm done. I'm going to pull this out. They're going to be over the messy projects by now after that other week. Okay, so, guys, you can make it as big or as small as you want. I wanna make these kinda smaller, and you just work with it. Like, see, I'm just pushing it down, working with it. Make it the size that I want. Obviously, you're going to make like a little, just a bird's nest. Push your fingers down. See? Here's one. See what I mean, guys? Alright. I got a towel because I know this is going to be very sticky. So, I'm going to lay this towel down, guys. Because I don't want to get this all over everything. I'm going to make two while I'm spraying. Just do two at the same time. Gosh, guys, this moss. I bought two bags. This would be enough to definitely make six, all six of them. So just push your thumbs down is all I'm doing. And kind of pulling the sides up. So you're going to start with your adhesive spray. And this, like I said, this is messy, guys. So I don't want to get this all over everything on my table. This could have probably been an outside project, but that's okay. Here we are. And it's asleep, so I kind of just got a little bit to just do what I can with my time. This is very sticky, guys. Oh my gosh, very sticky. I actually brought some wipes to use in between. This is gonna be just to hold it together. We'll let that set for a little bit. Do this one. And guys, even if you don't want to use these on your dining room table, like me on my little um, dishes and placemats and stuff, you could use these um, like anywhere on your hutch, on a book, in the kitchen. Um, you could even get like a little, um, if you have a tiered tray, you could do this um, on that. So sticky, guys. Just gonna warn you already. It's a messy project. All right. So this is just holding it together. But you see, we got the little hole in there for my birds, birds' eggs. I feel like this one needs to be together more. Do 
is want to stick to me instead of a stuff. I'm still gonna work with it, even though it's sticky as I don't know what. <laughs> Cause it's drying. This stuff is gluing this together. So where you put it is where you want it to be. See? All right, so, so in a bird's nest, they also got some grass, right? So here's some green, I don't know if you can see the true color. Um, I wanna put just randomly a little bit of green on the sides. Guys, once this dries, you can kind of push them down too. All right, so now <laughs> my tree over here, I'm gonna peel, take some of these off, not peel. Well, I can't get attacked by it. All right. So, you know, birds and nests are not perfect, guys. And they've got limbs in them and sticks and stuff. So, I'm just going to put these randomly in here. Still wet. So I got the, you got the hole down in the middle, guys, for your eggs. We've got some green grass, some moss, and we got our sticks in here. So what I like to do, guys, is get little, um, just like those um, decorative eggs, like the robin egg blue and the yellows. I would love to get those um, to put in these and just sit for decoration. Trying to push down in the middle, guys. Make sure you've got, make it look like a bird's nest, that hole in the middle where they lay, where they nest. All right. So I've got two of them. And once you get done, you're gonna spray it with the clear acrylic sealer. I got all these at Walmart, guys. All the the stuff's at Walmart. But all the stuff for the bird's nest itself is from the Dollar Tree. This is stuff will stay where you want it to. So cute guys, little bird's nest. So imagine this, um, like I said, if I've got a, a plate, this and like a bowl with some little eggs in it, like some, like a, the robin egg, um, robin egg, Lord, robin blue eggs down in here, little bitty baby ones. Be so cute. So there's one, one Easter, um, Easter, Lord, one bird's nest. And I know this is not like this isn't most of the time Easter you think bunnies, um, but to me, it's spring, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. All right, and here's my other one. 
So I've got the hole there. I'm ready to lay my eggs in. So we've got two bird's nests, guys. So all this cost me, um, these were a few dollars a piece. And then um, I only used one bag of the Spanish moss, but like I said, this is just for two. So I'm going to be making six of these. And then you'll just need one bag of the reindeer moss. So um, around like seven bucks to make these. Cute, cute. So here we've got our DIY bird's nest that I'm going to be using on my table. Um, if you guys make these, remember this is very, very, very messy. I mean, I've got stuff stuck all over me. Um, but they are so cute. So it took us, what, around 10 minutes to make two of these. So if you guys make these, um, if you got me on Instagram or Facebook or text me, show me what you do with them. Show me um, what your table looks like or where you put them or what you put in them. Or if you just leave them by their stuff like this. And this would be cute, guys, on the porch, too, for decoration. Like, I've got a shelf on my porch that my granny gave me. This would be cute sitting on it with some eggs in it, too. People probably think it was real low. <laughs> but um, I got some twigs falling out. So, yeah. Here are our um, bird's nest, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video, even though this is a very messy one. Very, very messy. It's going to take me a few minutes to clean up after this. Um, but um, I'll be on here um, a little bit later, maybe, to show you guys another, some more stuff for spring and Easter. Just because it's here, it's on us, so I need to be showing you guys some ideas. Even if it's more than one a week. I don't know, maybe doing um, more. So, here we are. I hope you guys like them. Thank you for watching.